What is up, YouTube? This is Sergeant Ghost. This is a squirrel. And this is a video on the YouTube viewer attention span. Now, don't get all butt hurt because I made this video bitching about you guys. Because the thing is, I'm bitching on myself too. Because when I'm not uploading videos, I'm viewing videos. So, I'm in this group also. The first thing I wanted to touch on mm, is video views and what I like to call hollow views. I'm sure there's an actual term for it, but that's just what I'm going to call it for now. So just because your video has, let's just say, a thousand views, that does not mean a thousand people actually saw your damn video. I was going straight off the number of views, thinking everything was fine and dandy, like, oh shit, I almost got a thousand views on my one video. Wrong. Luckily, I couldn't sleep, and I spent a good deal of time going through the YouTube analytics for my videos. Everything seemed pretty normal in there until I got to this little tab labeled viewer retention. And I noticed a common theme on most of my videos, and that is throughout my 15 second intro, almost 75% of my viewers are dropping out before the damn video even starts. You guys realize how ridiculous that is? Let me put it another way. Out of every 800 viewers I have, only 200 viewers make it to the goddamn video. And this is where I came up with the term hollow views. Because those viewers didn't actually view my shit. And I know a lot of you are thinking, well, who the hell cares of views of you? No, the fuck it isn't. This is what YouTube is supposed to be about, is uploading content and people watch it. Why the fuck would I care if they click on it and don't view it? just for a view. That is retarded and backwards. And the thing is, it's only because we're small YouTubers. If I was, say, Woody's Gamertag or White Boy, I could upload a 20 minute video about clipping my damn toenails and I could probably retain 80 to 90 percent of my viewers. But because we're a small YouTuber, we, we gotta snag people right in the beginning. We gotta, we gotta have great content. We gotta have a personality. We gotta have charisma, all this shit, so that these no attention span heaven YouTubers don't go, oh my god, who does this motherfucker think he is with a 15 second intro? Click. And I know you guys are probably thinking, goddamn ghost, you gonna bitch about it enough or are you gonna do something about it? Yes, I have addressed this situation and I'm going to address it further in the future. First thing I did, which you may have already noticed, is I cut down my intro video from 15 seconds to, I believe it was 7 seconds. So hopefully those chunk of viewers that don't have longer than a 8 second attention span can actually get to my content before they start clicking off and shit like that. Another trick I'm going to try is I'm going to make my montage clips much much shorter and even my commentaries I'm gonna try to keep under the six minute mark another thing I want to talk about real quick is demographics this is something you definitely want to keep your eye on now if you take a look at my graph real quick almost 30 percent of my viewers are female and a great chunk of those come out of the UK and I uh, thank you guys very much for watching especially the ladies my point is Watch what you say on YouTube, because you definitely don't want to be doing dumb shit like, I'm an American and I'm better than everyone else, especially British females, or if you come out of the UK and you're like, oh, Americans are fat and lazy, you might end up losing subscribers and definitely a lot of views. Anyway, I'm sure only a handful of you guys are still listening anyway, so I think we'll go ahead and close out this rant. This is the Sergeant Ghost signing off. Saying a personal I love you to each and every subscriber, and I will see you guys in the next video.